we got the ribeye seasoned. I've got the iron skillet heating up. We're gonna get that thing, we're gonna get this thing really hot where the water dances on it so we can get a good sear on those steaks. So what you do is you turn up the that onto high heat. It'll probably start smoking. And then I'm gonna throw a steak on there and that steak will not be moved until it releases on its own. So what I mean by that is when you throw that steak in there, it's gonna to wanna to stick and that's what it's supposed to do. Well, if you try to flip it and it's not quite ready, it's not gonna come up off that pan, it's gonna stick. When it's ready to be flipped, it'll release. So you know when you go to flip it and it doesn't come off, it's not ready to go. So that's what we're gonna do. That's what we're talking about, ribeye. All right, so apparently it was creating too much smoke and the fire alarm went off, so I had to take the battery out of it because that thing will keep going off. All right, so I had to open up that window and open up the door because it was getting smoky in here. It smells great though. I don't know if you can see the smoke, but it's sucking it right out. Skillet going. It's gonna be some good eating tonight, y'all. Isn't it, Jake? Jake knows it's gonna be good eating too, because I usually feed him with steak also whenever I'm having steak. So. Usually whatever I have, Jake gets, unless it's a little bit too spicy. That would not be very good for a great thing to get sick inside the house. Which he's very well potty trained. But he has been sick once, and luckily, it was on the tile. See that crusty sear out there? That's what we're talking about. What I need to get is one of those little iron weights so I can just stick it right on top of the steak. Need to put that on the list. Using my cutting board here for a little backstop so the grease doesn't get all over the other appliances. Works out pretty good. And this cutting board is the perfect size to fit right over the sink. So I can actually put it right over the sink and use it to actually put stuff on. And I can cut my veg veggies or whatever I need to cut up there. All right, so I think we're almost done. Now we're gonna turn off the heat and we're gonna cover it. We're gonna let it sit. Let's take a look. Oh yeah, yeah, that looks good. You can see a little bit of red there. The juice is coming up. All right, I think we're good. All right, ladies and gentlemen, all finished. It's time to chow down on some grub. If you don't mind, it's time for me to eat. What you doing, Jake? 